Good evening everybody, once again welcome back to Power Distribution Channel. Today we are going to be watching the changeout process of single phase transformer that has been broken due to uh, secondary bushing failures. This transformer is supplying a small outside campus along with the dormitory for the student. As you can see here, there are two low voltage cable coming out from the secondary bushing, each serves 22 kVh load for the buildings. First, the crew open the cutout and sometimes cutout can be hard to open due to weathering. Then the crew starts deploying ladders. This is the new jumper that will be replaced the old one. Since this is an offline maintenance, the groundmen are checking the voltage present on the feeder using hot stick attached with a voltage detector. This is a safety protocol to double check whether the feeder is really has been de-energized and confirm this is the brand new transformer that will be replaced the old one on the pole this is the breaker time plate and the secondary pushings 50 kvh and this is the nine plate for the primary voltage and the secondary voltage. Ground crew attach the secondary bushing before the transform being lifted and installed on the pole. Tap changer to adjust the voltage levels. The crew are busy uh, detaching all the jumpers, primary, secondary, the ground wire. This is a completely self protected transformer with surge resistors attached. Transformer already being attached to the crane for extra safety, and the crew are changing side to detach all the secondary uh, jumpers. Ground crew are transferring some additional tools to the linemen. The linemen are cutting all the old wires and jumpers to be replaced with the new jumpers prepared by the ground team. And now the transformer is being detached from the pole by undoing two bolts which hold the transformer from its bracket. The brackets are being adjusted to accommodate the new transformer. The new transformer being loaded, ready to be installed. Let's take a closer look at the old transformer. It has severely weathered. As you can see, it is from 2002 with almost 17 years. This is the secondary bushing which causes the failure. As you can see, a significant amount of melted wires fuses into the secondary bushing. A significant play from the bushings indicates the insulation has been compromised. The new shiny transformer are being lifted and ready to be installed.
protect never operates or transformer breaker because it will cause you a lot of trouble attaching the new transformer to the bracket and the lineman changing side to install the primary jumpers and the arrester jumpers attaching the transformer common neutral to the feeder uh, neutral Then reinstall the primary jumpers to the fuse cutout. Reinstalling the bird guards or animal guards to the primary bushing and the search arrester. And last but not least, crimps the X1 and X2 jumpers to the existing uh, distribution cable. And now the installation is complete and the transformer is ready to be energized. That's you have it guys, the change your process of broken single phase transformer. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more video in the future. Thank you very much.